decide how they feel about one candidate or another when it comes to religious issues which are very important in their daily lives true but one of the things that, that Reverend Warren has been saying and is pretty adamant about it is he's going to focus on sort of four categories here uh, the first series of questions will be about leadership which is really his uh, code words for moral values issues what makes a guy what's make the candidates tick uh, honor integrity uh, what drives them individually then he'll go to a section about stewardship which will really be more about uh, how they would govern for instance on a Republican side of an issue it would be uh, what sort of judges are you going to pick for the Supreme Court and uh, Wright will delve into those questions with both candidates and then comes later with both domestic and international issues so it won't be limited to faith and interestingly he's going to ask both candidates identical questions as they come up first senator obama and later senator mccain now under the rules mccain's not supposed to be able to hear the questions so he doesn't have any kind of unfair advantage by going second uh... they were going to put him in what they euphemistically referred to as the cone of silence here on the grounds uh... but he's not going to actually arrive until about halfway through obama's conversation with Wright. so theoretically he could be listening on the radio, but all the signals are that he's going to uh, keep his ears closed and keep the playing field level. All right, Carl Cameron in California. Thank you much, Carl. By the way, you can catch the Saddleback event right